Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see about chili diversity, the chilies and different types in it. Right now, we are in a chili field and capsicum annum is the widely grown variety in India. The species name annum means annual. The plant is actually not annual but frost tender. In the absence of winter frost, it can survive several seasons and grow into a large shrubby perennial herb. The single flowers are an off-white, sometimes purplish color while the stem is densely branched and up to 60 cm tall. The fruit are berries that may be green, yellow, orange or red when ripe. While the species can tolerate most frost-free climates, capsicum annum is especially productive in warm and dry climates. The local chilies are produced by crossing the wild varieties with the local varieties and making them suitable for eating and other purposes. They are the domesticated chilies. The fresh green chili used in Indian cooking is often the cayen type, about 7.5 cm long and slender. Its heat can vary from mild to fiery. The only way to judge the heat is by tasting a tiny piece of skin from the middle section. The top of the chili with most seeds is always the hottest, the bottom tip the mildest. The hot seeds of chili are never removed in India. The fruits of chilies can generally be eaten at any stage of the ripening process. However, the flavor will change as the ripening process occurs. When the fruit are green, they tend to be slightly bitter and as they move towards red or yellow, they tend to sweeten in taste and also lose some of their heat. Chilies are generally dried by keeping them in the sun for the whole day until the sun sets, doing it for at least three days in a row. While drying chilies using direct sunlight, we make sure that you start as early as possible to get as much as light as possible. Chili powder is the dried pulverized fruit of one or more varieties of chili pepper, sometimes with the addition of other spices and also sometimes known as chili powder blend. It is used as a spice to add pungency and add flavor to dishes. The banana pepper is a medium sized member of chili pepper family that has a mild tangy taste. It's often pickled, stuffed or used as a raw ingredient in foods. It prefer warmer climates and they are rich sources of vitamin C containing 100% of the daily value in a 100 gram reference amount table. Vitamin B6 is present in substantial content of 28% DV with no other micronutrients in appreciable amounts. The bell pepper is a cultivator group of the species Capsicum annum. Cultivators of the plant produce fruits in different colors including red, yellow, orange, green, white and purple. Bell peppers are sometimes grouped with the less pungent pepper varieties as sweet peppers. In some languages, the term paprika, which has its roots in the words for pepper, is used for both the spice and fruit, sometimes referred to by their color. The Suryum chilies were released in 1996. Plants are tall, spreading and branching habit from ground level. Leaves are broad and dark green. Fruits are smooth, medium long, born in cluster of 5 to 6 and upright erect. It is tolerant to thrips and wilt. The Mund chili is grown in Tamil Nadu and Andhra. They are small and round with a thin skin. It has a very unique flavor. They are barely spicy but have a unique flavor which enhances the flavors of many dishes. Andhra cuisine is famous for its extremely spicy dishes and the chili responsible for this is the Guntur Sannam S4. The Sannam chili has many varieties that are grown not only in Andhra but also in states such as Madhya Pradesh. Known for its heat, unless one is used to such a high level of spiciness, you will find many people in tears when eating delicious Andhra dishes. As the name suggests, it's grown extensively in the region. This chili has become so popular, it's exported to all over the world. It accounts for roughly 30% of India's chili exports. Jodhpur is one of the famous chili growing districts of Rajasthan. It's the best place for those who are fond of spicy food. Jodhpur chilies are famous not only throughout India but abroad also. The most famous one is Matania's Red Chili of Jodhpur. It is famous for its reddish color. It is sent to many parts of this country and even exported to other countries. 
The Kandari chili belongs to the variety of capsicum frutescens. The Kandari chili is grown in Kerala and some parts of Tamil Nadu in India. It is an awesome looking plant which tends to get quite bushy and grow similar to Tabasco. The Kandari chili is an amazing producer of small pointy white or ivory colored chili pots that ripen to a beautiful orange color. The chili pots are approximately 2.5 cm long and 0.6 cm wide. This is a chili plant we highly recommend because not only it is an awesome producer, it also looks fantastic and has a great flavor. These chili peppers is the fruit of plants from the genus Capsicum, members of the nightshade family Solanaceae. Chili peppers are widely used in many cuisines to add spiciness to dishes. The substances that give chili peppers their intensity when ingested or applied topically are capsaicin and related compounds known as capsinoids. Chili peppers originated in Mexico. After the Columbian exchange, many cultivators of chili pepper spread across the world used for both food and traditional medicine. Worldwide in 2014, 32.3 million tons of green chili peppers and 38.8 million tons of dried chili peppers were produced. China is the world's largest producer of green chilies, providing half of the global total.